Hey guys, Scott Sullivan here from Classical Theist, and in this short video we're going to talk about the main positions people take on the question of whether or not God exists. Alright, so when you approach this question of whether or not God exists and is God real, I think it's helpful to keep in mind the main camps or the main positions that people take on this question. The first one would be the theist position. That's the position that holds that God does exist. That's a, an obvious one that many people take. And you would have what would be the polar opposite of that, the atheist position that holds that God does not exist. So uh, sometimes people get this term confused. They'll say something like, well, atheism just means I don't have any beliefs about God. You see, so they just say the atheist view is not having any beliefs at all about the issue. But clearly that's not sufficient. That's not a good definition. After all, this bookshelf here doesn't have any views about God either. It doesn't have any beliefs at all about God, but this bookshelf is not an atheist. So the atheist uh, is committed, I think, to the denial of the claim that God does exist. In other words, they are logically committed to the claim that God does not exist. So it's important to keep that uh, clarification in mind. And finally, you might have a middle-of-the-road position, an agnostic position. That's the position that holds that, well, I don't know if God exists. And there can be two kinds of agnostics. There's the agnostic that's, that's more of a, a negative agnostic. Someone that says, I don't know if God exists, but maybe someone else does. Or you could have the more positive agnostic that says, well, I don't know if God exists and nobody else knows either, you see. So those are the main positions that people take on this question. And I think it's helpful to keep these positions in mind. Okay, now if you like this video and you want to receive more like it, then go ahead and click this subscribe button right here. Click this button and what that will do is that it will subscribe you to my channel and what that means is that whenever I release a new video, you'll be notified about it right away. Also, I want to give you a copy of my free book. Click this image right here. This is my free How to Answer a Jesus Critic book. So click this image. It'll take you over to my website. You can give me your email address and I'll email you a copy of this book. It's just a quick little read on how to answer the most common objections to Christianity. Now, if you're on a mobile device right now, these links in the video won't work, but they're right down there in the video description. I want to thank you for watching this video, and God bless.